Hey love bugs, it's Ross, I'm back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed today. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and I definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, welcome, much love to you. And for my returning subs, my extended growing family, thank you so much for the support and the loving vibes that you're sending. I mean, y'all are just, we're just spreading around abundance and it, it just feels so good. So from the bottom of my heart, for everything, the, just the good vibes that you just send out and you being you, you being you makes me so happy. And from the bottom of my heart, thank you. You keep being you and you keep walking in your truth. So with that being said, much love to you. Namaste. Love and blessings, love and light, and many blessings are yet to come for you. And if you've been watching my videos for a while and have not subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Like and subscribe, even hit that notification bell so you know when your girl's uploading her video. Or if you feel like you want to drop a line or two, go ahead and drop me a line. I would love a chance to know you as much as you're knowing me. Or even if this would give me positive feedback on my video or even just giving your opinion about the content of my video or you're just telling me about your empathic gift it's all greatly appreciated as long as it's positive and thank you so much for stopping by my channel and i hope you can be able to get something out of my video today and the song uh, man this is like my third time making my video i was gonna show y'all my cat irma that i got but she just she's in here with my other cat and you know they're just trying to get to know each other so it's like a, Ow! it's just too much for that but anyways it's um the meditation music I'm listening to today, which is so beautiful, is called Control Unwanted Emotions and Stress, Healing Music for Anxiety. Anxiety, Stress, Depression, Meditation Music. That is so beautiful, especially I need that right now. With all the crazy things that's going on. I hope everybody is doing good. You know, y'all need to let me know how y'all doing. Drop me some lines. And my video today oh, I almost had to look the other way the video today is about uh, twin flame 101 hey hey okas on SOS saving ourselves the lunar eclipse uh, the lunar eclipse symptoms yes the lunar eclipse symptoms Boy, I've been going through all this crazy stuff I didn't think I was gonna make no video today y'all I didn't because it was just like my emotions was going so crazy it was like I was going up and down up and down up and down and it's just like i know the adult me is okay but it's just like when i go to that inner child that becomes very sensitive so it was just like i know when i see my my childlike self i just want to hug her you know because she really been through a lot of stuff she really did and it was just like so emotional and it was just like for the last couple of days i've been fine you know i'm making videos i'm talking to y'all y'all been sending me a plethora <laughs> a plethora of comments which i've been loving i, I just love it when y'all just send me comments every day it's just so beautiful but it, it's just like all the different things that you know that you're going through different emotions intense dreams i mean i'm fighting through a headache right now y'all i'm fighting through a headache and it was just like it feels like a flu-like symptoms you might have feelings of disgust you might have feelings of sorrow you might have feelings of agitation angry just just you don't want to be bothered it's like i don't want to be bothered <laughs> okay it's like one of those type days or you know yeah a couple of days and it's just like i'm just so ready for this lunar eclipse to be over because it, it seems like it's really affecting hay us right now or just impasse period it's really affecting us because it's just like trying to make us purge out all our past hurt all our past trauma whatever we're going through they want us just to go through it and it's just like SOS. I, you know, there's so many meanings behind that acronym SOS. But my mind is save ourselves because it's just so many times there. There's times I look 
you know, just the vent with people. And it's just like, there's some things that you need to keep to yourself. And there's just times where, you know, you might get upset and you might call somebody. Then all of a sudden you're like, dang, either they can't talk right now or the phone's busy or they're just texting like, you know, you know, that, you know, they're at work right now or they're talking, you know, they're driving, they can't talk. So basically it's like the universe telling you they're, they're blocking everybody so you can be able to heal on your own because it's just like, you know, they might be having stuff going on with themselves so you don't need to be bothering them with your stuff or, you know, there's just certain people that you just can't tell stuff to because they prey upon your, your misfortune. They really do. But it's just like, you know, me with mine, it's just like, yeah, I have a misfortune but I'm healing from the things that I've had to deal with. So, I mean, you can laugh at it all you want to. I mean, it just tells people about their character. But it's just like we all go through things. We all go through them. And it's just like whatever stages in our life that needs healing, that would be the most things that will start coming up. Or it's just things. It could be just, you know, it would be a blessing. When I can hear people say, you know, things are great. I'm loving that when I can hear people saying they got good things going on for them. But it's just like, you know, it gives me comfort when I can be able to help somebody with their problems or be able to talk to them about things. And, you know, it's just like when I hear somebody talk down about themselves, you know, it it bothers me. You know, because it's just like, you know, there's sometimes where, I, you know, you just feel like, dang, my life is going to be like this forever. You never want to say that. You know, yeah, it might be like that right now. But you never know what's right around the corner. You never know. And it's just like when we go through our things, the universe needs to see. Are they trying to save, them, save themselves? Are they trying to reach out and do everything they possibly can to do what they can do? Yes. Okay. Then next thing you know, your blessing come right in. You come right in. Because there's days I cry. There's days, you know, I can see, like, pictures of my dad or videos of my dad. And I'll just burst out into tears, especially if there's certain songs that trigger me. Or, you know, I know there's songs that he, he is, you know, made about me or whatever. You know, it, it really gets to me. And it's just like, you know, he doesn't want you to be this way. You know, he wants you to be happy. He wants to see you smiling. You know, all these things. But, you know, it's just hard to do that when, you, when you've missed out on so much. And I try not to dwell on the parts that I miss. I just try to be blessed on the, on the times I was be able to, you know, was able to share with my father. Because my dad was always on the road. He was always busy. You know, especially, you know, I didn't know who he was to me at the time. So, you know, he tried to get in where he could fit in, you know. But it, it was just a blessing that I can just say, you know, even though I, I see the sad things that we both went through, I can actually say the love was there. You know, even though people kept us apart, the love was always there. So... It's just like when you're going through things, don't, you know, it, it's just like some things we need to handle on our own. And, you know, it's not always, you know, there's always good times that you need to, you know, talk and vent to people when you need to say what you need to say. But it's just a lot of times it's like when people tell you they don't want to talk right now, it's not because they're trying to be a voidy or whatever. It's just they're, they're trying to handle things on their own. They're trying to get their life straight so it's just like when things are blocked for you like when you're trying to reach out to somebody and say oh I need to just talk to this person or whatever it might be you know hey just just deal with this the best way you can for your own so it's just like we can't look for other people to save us especially when you're like dealing with twin flames you can't look for your twin flame to save you that's the whole point on them coming in your life when they did because they're trying to mirror you on the things that you need to excel on. All you know, all the, they're your yin to your yang. Whatever they lack on, you excel on, and vice versa. So it's it's just like when we all have to save ourselves. It's like people come into our lives for healing, validation, comfort, clarity, you know, and and lessons and blessings. 
And we need to take those things for as they are and save ourselves. You know, and I know that's hard to do at times because there's people out there that, that is really going through some stuff. Trust me, I know I'm still going through some stuff, but I always try to find a silver lining out of it, even when it's hard to see it. I try to see it. You know, try to find positive things. I try to be goofy at times because, you know, life is too short to be miserable. There's nothing to, you know, we, I, I tell, I say that all the time. We weren't on this universe for us to be miserable, unhappy, you know, being hateful to people, being d- divided because of sexual orientation or ethnic backgrounds and religions. You know, I mean, it's, we all call, we all bleed the same way. And when we all die, you can't take nothing with you. So, you know, just know that you need to save yourself. We'll be okay. You're strong. You know you were strong, especially if you're a hey, okay, You were strong, mother. Shut your mouth. Jesus. Because you, we go through... <laughs> we go through so much. <laughs> you dealing with your stuff and a thousand others, too. So you know if you can get through that day, knowing it's a day-to-day basis. Don't be hard on yourself. You know, you slip up. It's always another day to start off brand new, so remember that. So I hope you were able to get something out of this message. You know, gave you some kind of resignation. You know, I said resignation. You get some, you will be able to resonate with this. That's what I meant to say, y'all. Like I said, this daggone headache is killing me. (laughs) I know my head is hurting. But, yeah, I hope you were able to get something out of that message. Like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell. Drop me a line. I would love to hear from you as much as you're hearing from me. So now as much love and light as possible. Know you are highly favored and you are forever loved. And you are blessed. And know there is always somebody out there praying for a better day for you as well as yourself. So I will see you on my next video. Stay blessed. Stay prosperous. Namaste. Peace and be wild.